Hello everybody, welcome back to more Undermine Other Mind Streak in Time with Space Time! That doesn't rhyme! That does? Uh, okay. You know what? I cannot remember. I don't think we've done a Phoenix run. I don't... I don't remember. If we, I don't think we've done a Spirit run either. Since we got a potion upgrade, I think we're gonna go for that. So we can, uh, we can pick up three potions. This is a potion-focused pet, for sure. Uh, it looks like we got a lot of mostly throw damage, so let's go for the crit blessing there. Uh, temporary damage from picking up gold or bambushka. Oh. Let's go with temporary damage from picking up gold. And then this is the real stinker. These are two really bad, really bad curses. I'm going to go with mutation just because it's easier to get rid of. And we do have a potion pet who levels up based off of drinking potions, so... I don't know. Uh, there's some situations. They're few and far between, but they definitely exist. Where potions are way better, they can be way better than a relic. I would say that is not the average case scenario. I'm really glad we got to that in time. Uh, what's up with this visual right there? It almost makes me think we should uh, check down there for a secret room. Maybe. I don't. I don't know if that's a. I mean, it's. Whatever it is, it's not on purpose. I can't I can't imagine that, that was like a it's a real on purpose thing. This could definitely just be a potion. It was not. Chance on hit to ignite your enemies. We do not have any bombs, we actually can't do the uh the check right there, but alas alas, the ability to cook all meat is really good and uh, light all torches. Don't mind if I do. Da -da -dum. It's it's nice to have such a clear, clear start for a, for a stat to go off of. Going for this here, uh, the the throw run kind of it, it seems like the logical conclusion. Love that we got ourselves a new crown finally as well. Um, I think that it would be a wise idea to get rid of this. Like no matter no matter what, I I think we should get rid of it. Like yes. There are definitely situations where potions are better, and this is a very good pet to get leveling up quick because we can get, uh, you know, additional potions. I don't know. I can't. Why can't I remember? I feel like we may have we may have used this pet. I can't remember, man. I can't remember for the life of me. Uh, if we did, it was not a it was not a major part of the run. We should have definitely gone back to pick up the meat. Oh well. Okay, let's get our act together here. I feel like we just made a. Uh, we made a, a, a silly choice or so right there, but I think we'll be all right, all right. Uh, yeah, I do really like how clear-cut the beginning stats are. You know, we can we can uh, pick our items accordingly. Swing throw is very much a uh, logical combo right now still, though. Early on, especially before you get items, swings are generally, like, a little more powerful on the average. So they're still, like, very worth doing. Got ourselves a oh my god. Oh my oh my god. <laughs> okay. I'll definitely take lava walkers. Uh they're the better of the two. Uh parts of the Helios boots synergy. So now if we see galoshes, we will take them a hundred percent. I think that I might have read the patch notes saying that Helios boots and maybe galoshes. Make it so you can't be poisoned from the ground? I, I'm i not positive that that is true. I And I also, I guess, I don't know exactly everything that that would be in relation to. Obviously, that would, that would have to stop the poison on the ground from uh, the nasty new poison worm enemies, which is a, a valid concern. Definitely a valid concern. Uh, what else would it be, though? Like... It can't be those enemies that drop the poison. Ooh, that's too far, isn't it? Yep. Who drop the poison down I in like a splash lob formation. I don't think that that would be the case. I thought that was the reverse trade. All right. So, I guess we're out of here. But if, if so, you know, anything to make galoshes just a little bit better is a good deal in my book. Because typically it's... It's just kind of like piece one of the Helios Boots synergy. 
Uh, explosiveness helps us out with Large Ember. Large Ember's AoE damage does actually scale off of bomb damage. So, why not? We do have to be, like, a little bit more careful than we already would want to be. Uh, we don't have any bomb damage upgrades naturally from the original chest. But still, you, like... I'm going to want to be a, like, a little bit more careful, I, I guess, with my bombs. But we always, always want to be careful anyways. Yep. I typically avoid taking that stat unless I'm, like, on a bomb run. And the weird thing is, like, I feel like it doesn't... It doesn't help in a bomb run as much as you would think. Because typically for a bomb run, you have, like, one of the two or three ways to uh, increase your bomb damage just naturally. I can't, I can't not, right? It's very good, but it's one of those items that it's, it's so good, but it kind of does, it monopolizes a run a little bit. Definitely, and honestly, I think that'll be good too. And you know what, 50, I, I feel like even if we're not doing a swing focus run, we have the ability to do the swing throw combo for sure right now, and it's, it's definitely in the in the territory where it's a good idea. So we might as well buff it up for 50. Like, it gets diminishing returns, but will it cost 50 when it costs 100? Those are probably nice times to to just fork over the cash anyways. Um, when it gets to like 150, 200, maybe, maybe we'll start to reconsider it. Sell it first, eh? What is this? Normal game mode? Yep. This is some burst damage. Oh, it's it's just this is such a natural clean run. One two. One two. One two. Ooh. The fire from that and from the uh the AoE going at the same time makes it sound like we are absolutely shrekking at Celt. The fire damage does appear to stay even when self is off screen, which is nice. No! Not a lot I could have done there. Just trying to get close enough for the uh, large amber to do some work. There we are. Yeah. I wanted to do the, uh, the bomb. Oh, well. Oh, well. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Okay. That positioning was stupid, but we were okay. We were doing, uh, like, crazy fast, crazy easy uh, clearing in the earlier part of that fight, but then it got kind of... It slowed down quite a bit there. Quite a bit there. 40 HP. Don't mind it. Don't mind it. And I will definitely take a gold income up. And I will indeed take Blood Offering, even though it has caused some issues. I really should have picked up Kurtz's stash first. And to avoid embarrassment, I'm going to just take Cirque du Soleil. Might as well. I think it has, like, weird... A weird issue where it doesn't proc in the first room. Oh, no... Okay. Oh! That enemy is a stink master. All right. One, two, go. Clean, just clean damage. Oh, it's just, it's just, mwah. Magnifique. I feel like fortitude's harder to come by, so I typically go for it uh, over HP. I don't know that that's a like a logical reason to go for it just because it's you know hard to come by it's the mcrib phenomenon yep but i yeah, it's, it's probably good no i don't want to do that because if we get a uh if we get a really bad curse then we're going to want to start removing our curses <laughs> not even not, not even worth the chance that we might possibly take, like, 12 damage. 
I just don't like that potion. It, it, it doesn't feel that good to me. Whoop. No bombs. God, seeker him to the north, seeker him to the south. Thank you, Cirque the Soleil. Unfortunately, I do not have uh, what you seek, the bombs. God, I love that large amber does not suck now. It used to be really bad. Like, it used to be so bad. And it was like a, it's a rare item, I guess. Isn't it? I think it is. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Four keys. I'm gonna head to both of these. Uh, maybe pick up a meat on the way out. Ah, okay. Okay, yeah. Inverter. Every time you remove a curse, it turns into a blessing. Uh, it's kind of, it's a semi-death sentence for finding Omegalol, but I don't care. This is so good. So good, so good, so good, so good. Uh, I'll even pick up this because we do have the curse right now. That makes it so, you know, we're basically going to be generating gold for a little while. And we're not going to really, you know, not have to spend any. You're just going to make some. Normally got to spend money to make money. We don't got to spend no money to make no money right now. We just spend no money, make all the money. Pretty darn good. But, I mean, it's really the only downside of an inverter. Inverter, before uh, before Omega Lol even got added to the game, which was a really good update, by the way. Uh, before Omega Lol was added to the game, inverter was one of those, like, absolute top I top top tier uh items and I, it still is but like now it, I think I think it's in a healthier spot now because now I see well hello there walk and jump on oil and poison hey would you look at that and now Helios boots will do that as well uh so now every time we jump not only will we put down fire we'll put down a, an oily fire pool which is nice because, uh, first of all, it does slow down enemies a decent chunk. Uh, so they're going to be stuck in it, taking that damage more often. Also, well, I should go. But, uh, yeah, yeah. Oh. That damage is crazy. Sorry. Uh. Okay, well, obviously, we're going to try and bomb our way in there from the other way. Is that something to do with... I wonder if that's something to do with um. the uh, Cirque du Cirque Soleil. I can't ever remember uh, what it's actually called. All right, well... I can't really tell exactly where that stuff is. I mean, like, I see the shadows, but it's tough to really see where it lands. Uh, but yeah, I wonder if that has to do with the, the Cirque du Soleil item. We lost our uh, our buff there, which is a shame because there's HP right here. Boink. Okay. Just generate this money for later. We could get a throw distance up, but as far as I'm concerned, it's one of my least favorite upgrades. Uh, how gracious of you, a patron of the arts. We are losing our time. <laughs> Ooh. It's worth it. It's a bop. Do we really get... We, we always just get to pick whatever we want? That's crazy good. Uh, the question is, what do I want? What do I want? What's going to make the biggest difference for us right now? Um, hmm. Probably duplicator, right? I guess, probably. So now every time we, for the rest of the run that we see items, we get uh, the choice between two. At least in uh, actual legitimate item rooms. 
Oof. Oof. We lost a lot of time on our uh, Ursa Major, but that's that's okay. I, I I don't love playing like around Ursa Major, anyways. All right, don't care too much about a lot of that stuff, so I'm just gonna ditch. We got a blessing. We got throw speed. Hey, why not, man? Why not? Just good. Okay, freebie. All right. Good, 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 good. Oh my goodness, sketchy. That was pretty good. That was really like, I'm, I'm, I'm pleased with my, uh, the timing on my movements there. That could have gone so much worse. He's definitely, oh, easy to fight with swings, but oh well. Okay. Kind of got like a very fire focused run today. I would have really enjoyed having the Phoenix, or not the Phoenix, the um, Firebird. We would have been doing so much damage. I saw that key. Don't worry. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. I just had to do everything in my power to avoid those, uh, the trap that does. I'm gonna die. The, the trap that does a crazy amount of damage. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, uh. What? Oh, two bombs for everything? Okay, that's not that bad. It's not that bad. Please have meat. Two bombs, and we are sailing meat. You know, the phrase that is oft said. Uh, ooh, uh, I would like another shop. Oh, gosh. This is, this is grim. We're probably not going to get those bombs, which is really a bummer. Really a bummer. can't really that that perspective is super tough to to figure out his attack from okay here's the thing that gives us the uh the tent normally i would probably pick the other way around um on an average run in an average situation with an average amount of hp left however that's not where we're at today. We uh, we got we got bopped by the oh I well shoot I should have looked bopped by that uh, that one trap. This is super 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 good timing on this tent. Run savingly good timing. But yeah, I feel like uh, they need to normalize the uh, amount of damage that the traps on this floor do in other mind. I'm going to keep on saying it every episode just in case the devs tune in to one specific episode. It It is something that needs to be changed. They do so much more <laughs> on this... on, uh, on Like, when you get this floor, it's just so much more. It's, it's wild. It's just wild. All right, going down, we're probably not going to be getting... Um, oh, okay. I can, I can deal with Nori. Probably gonna be losing our Ursa Major, but you know, tis with tis. At least we got the meat in the floor as we left. Oof. Bad frame drop. We good though. Okay. So we do have the ability to light the torches. That's why I'm like. A little bit, you know, happier about this fight than normal. Doesn't seem like it would be a thing that would be that big of a deal, but it really does net you, like, a lot more um, free time to do damage. Since the more torches uh, that are snuffed out, the less damage you do. I mean, you can see that really, like, that makes a pretty substantial difference. Did that orb just get blocked by... 
It get it got blocked by our pool. That's a. Uh, it's one of them rare bugs that's... Yeah, do you see that? Oh, I try... I try... Yeah, that's the thing. One of them rare bugs that's actually, like, really beneficial to the player. Uh, we can actually block that. It's way more easy uh, for you to remember those bugs that uh, screw you over than ones like that where you're like, Oh, yeah, that actually works pretty well. Thank you. A little cheating. A little cheating action. can put down the... I, like, it's not supposed to be able to block the projectile, but that's something I have seen before in other weird situations. It just it just happens sometimes. Okay. Throw damage. Uh, what is our crit chance right now? It's probably really low. Oh, it's 13%, you say. Lock shops are extra locked. I, eh, I'll take no crits for now. Uh, I will start removing my curse. If we get rid of the one that we really, you know, the one that's helping us, then I'm going to say, okay, that's fine. It's, it, oh, I should not have done that. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. It's, like, I don't, obviously don't want it to go away, but losing the ability entirely to crit is something that is very much worth getting rid of. I just don't want to lock myself out of all shops. That just sounds terrible. I do want an item, though. Okay, Overstock the Shop is a very, 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 very strong item to me. I, I really, really like it, especially right now when we have Blood Offering. Uh, just a couple more food options is, is really good. It just seems like a small thing, but it is actually a big thing. Should pick up the money, even though we're not using it at the moment. We will start to. Ursa Major is gonna... Probably go. I, I like. I I like not being attached to it, though. I really do. I prefer runs where not everything revolves around it, because it's it's easy to make it surrounded by it. You know, I I wouldn't hate if it got tweaked in some way. Like, make the buff stronger, but last for a very short amount of time, and it does not replenish. That could be that could be a way to do it. You know. So like, you pick up a. Uh, Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, let's go to speed. Uh, I should have started removing. <laughs> I know that. I, I just got excited by what I saw. I, I, I see the swing size up, and it always makes me happy, even when we're not on the swing run. I get excited to see it. Always get excited to see it. Ooh, ooh baby. That's a, it's a painful one, but a good one at the same time. We're doing both. All right. Okay. Uh, no, I'm not gonna do it. No, I'm not gonna do it. So here's the thing. Like, it's probably smart to go for the exit right now because we're probably gonna run out of, uh, we're probably gonna run out of the Ursa Major. The thing that I don't want to have to be, like, the main focus right now for me. But I, I can't... I can't disregard it when I just spent that much, uh, that much HP. You know? Because if it goes away, we are... We're hurting pretty bad. Like, we're not in a golden spot right now. Ooh. Golden spot. Is there another shop? There is no... No, there's not another shop. You fool! Okay. Huge fingers crossed that there is a piece of food in here. I'll do it. What did we get? Throw damage? Throw damage? That's not bad. That's not bad at all. I don't know if that's what we got, but it's not bad at all. I definitely need to do the trick where we uh, save some of the meat in the shop. Because then we... Th that's the thing. Then we don't have to think about Ursa Major very much. You know? It's... Kind of just happens. You just come back. You double back through this, the, the floor. Pick up the meat on the way out. Like, we would have picked it up there. And we would have been replenished. We wouldn't have to think about it. That would be better. But this is probably a shop, so we're all good. Dude. Dude. Oh. Clean. Clean. 
Queen, 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 queen. Queen, 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 queen. 40, 421, okay. Hmm, not the one I wanted to get rid of, of course. Ooh, that actually didn't restore as much as I hoped. <laughs> oh god. I thought that it I thought it scaled higher. Okay. Should get some pretty decent restoration back from that. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Chance to not die when on death store is very, very good. Obviously. But, I don't know. I, I prefer to have something that's just, like, makes me less likely to be on death store. As straightforward as that seems, you know? I do see that secret room. I don't... I don't know. Was there a bomb up here that we just said no to because my health was precary-ish? No, we don't have, I mean, the evener outer doesn't give you, it doesn't give you one when you're at zero, right? Like, oops, it doesn't just, it doesn't just stonk you, you like that, I don't think. Oops, that was, yep, that, that's, that's right. <laughs> that is correct. Oh, bing bong. Bing, bong, bing. Do have an extra shop here? What is it at? Oh, we got tons. We got tons, man. I don't really want to block the next curses. I don't know why I bought that potion. Uh, does this really even make a difference? Nope, not really. <laughs> it, it really doesn't, but it will if we lose our uh, our buff. It definitely will then. Wow. What? Why are we doing so much damage? Hoppa. Why are we doing so much to them? Are they... They're not weak to throws, are they? Maybe they are. I feel like I'm doing like a lot of damage. Huh. I'll, I'll take it. I, I'm definitely am not complaining. I am confused. Did I? I did skip that meat up there. It's fine. We'll go get it. We'll go get it. There's one in the shop too, if we really care. Faster, please. Rarely feels worth it to me. Rarely feels worth it to me. Oh, no, I didn't miss the meat. It was just, it was just a different one. It's just a different one. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Ooh. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm, now I'm gonna go. We have the crit damage potion, which is hilarious because we cannot crit. We could drink it to just level up our pet, who is at the point where we will uh, we will gain oops potions out of chests at some points. I, if I'm gonna be real, I'm gonna kind of hope that we get rid of um, mediocrity. But I kind of figured that would not be the case. We got regeneration. Hey, I'll take it. So, yeah, we, we bought a lot of stuff and we still have... Ooh, we still have uh, 747 left over. That's definitely not bad. Oops. What am I doing? Uh-oh. Oh. Oh, I've had this nightmare. Oh, my God. This enemy is very concerning to me. I, I really, 
I really feel like. I feel like that enemy is going to put me in a situation where I have no choice but to die. And I hate the thought of that. Oh, I see that secret room there. Oh, I hate the thought of that. That, uh, could, like, being put in a situation where you have no choice but to die in a roguelike is a very huge no. I don't know that it's going to happen. Should we do this? Sure. Yeah, hey, yeah, that was definitely good. Gave us extra HP up. Okay. Oh my god, hello. Okay. Just felt like I wanted a little bit more, uh, a little bit more cleaned out uh, spaces there. A little bit more room to breathe, you know? Okay. I do. I like seeing all the little itty bitty numbers of the extra, like five, 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 five. Uh, we have five twenty of the item that I am not going to focus on. I, I'm concerned that we would uh, push those into the pit, so I'm just gonna say no to cooking them. As much as it would be nice, wouldn't it be nice if we could eat cooked meat instead of the raw meat on the floor? Okay. I feel like I haven't seen an actual item room in a while. I don't know why. Uh, don't care about these items. Uh, yeah, moldy, moldy food in chests is very, very good. It helps us not have to think as much about the thing that I'm not trying to think. I'm trying not to think about. Oh, 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 oh. Beautiful. Okay, so we actually have to purchase things. Uh, consumes. Uh, mm. Uh, no. Yes to this, though. Actually, you know what? For the sake of uh, leveling up our pet, we'll go for that. Typically, I feel like uh, the good way to level up this pet is just get a pet biscuits potion and then just like unleash, unleash hell. But we can't, you know? All right, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. Uh, ooh. Ah, I was gonna drink that, but then I was like, no, I can't. But I totally should have. Do we have Berserker's Brew? It might be worth it. All right, deal double, take double. That's double? That was, uh, I mean, I can't deny we're doing a lot. Oh, good. I love that we don't have to care about these fireballs. It's scary looking, but we don't have to actually care about them. I was like, <laughs> that's double? And then he just dies. Beautiful. Uh, some sort of key when you're using a key. Enemies hit with the throne pickaxe explode on death. Sounds a little bit better to me. Um, disable two relics. We don't know which ones it would get rid of. I hate it, but, you know, we're gonna get rid of it. All right, we're not gonna go for that one. <gasps> they fixed it! They fixed it! Or at least they fixed it right here right now which is good enough for me oh there's a secret room up there too ah freaking Cirque du Soleil oh see it's tricky because uh, this item makes it so you can find secret rooms in secret rooms so I saw it and I was like well you know there you go there you go loyalty shop discount why don't we do 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 do
do love that we move so fast right away in the room. It makes these guys not as big of a deal if we are so freaking fast. Yeah. So we can we can walk on this poison. Oh, get wrecked. Get wrecked by your own uh oh your own element. Ouch. What does this do? We are already ignited, but cool. Come on now. Pick up the pace. Pick up the pace. Pick up the pace. Pump up the jam. This is a shop if I've ever seen one. I don't want to do that stuff. Just do not care. Dun, 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 dun. Sure. Honestly, short of this as well. I'll take 75 to remove that. You better believe it. We get a blessing out of the mix too. Oh, that's right. We have to <laughs> have to think about money. Whoop, whoop. and uh, whoop, and uh, whoops, and I made a mistake. Uh, ooh. Wait, we don't have enough. It's 120. When I can't remember. Obviously, like that's like the best potion for us that we could uh, get there. You know what? Let's stand in here and oh, actually, we cannot convert. Two twelve. That is enough. That is enough. We're gonna go up. We're gonna get that. We're gonna pop that when the uh, Ursa Major is looking like it. I don't know why I did that. Just for fun, I guess. Looking like it's gonna run out. If we have the uh, poison buff on still, it wouldn't matter as much if our food got poisoned. I really feel like those ones, a lot of those potions that are just like not very exciting, like the, yeah, that new poison immunity one or the uh, ignite yourself. I feel like the least they can be for you is to, uh, fine. The least they can be is longer. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, maybe it's a niche effect, but at least it could go longer. Right? Like, at least maybe make it last. I, I, I think that they should change those potions to be a new type of potion that just lasts until the end of the floor. That's what I think. I think they would become way better, way more useful and valid. This is gonna have meat in it, so. Oh, and a way to remove, we, I mean, massive throw speed down. You know, it's not that bad. It's fine, it's fine. 860 HP up. Sure. This item is on par with all the other items. Sure. An 850 HP up. Sure. Sure, 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 sure. On par, yes. That massive throw damage down is noticeable. Or throw speed down. Oh. Never mind. It's not noticeable. Wow. Okay. Wow. Uh, uh, ow. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I would like a curse removal, though. <laughs> oh, God. I'm glad I have so much health. Uh, this is actually a really good item to get on this run, especially. Because a reroll... Yeah. A reroll that's also a potion you know, helps us scoot along with the uh, the leveling up process. The unfortunate truth is, even if we level up at this point, it's not going to be uh, effective for very long. We never got Pet Biscuits potions, and that's really, like, that's what you're... What the ever-living hell are you buffing? I thought they had to... I thought you had to buff an actual enemy. You buffed the corpse, my friend. You're going to have to let go. They're long gone. Good stuff. This is, uh, yeah, this has turned into a no-brainer stomp, but... That, that, that being said, Ursa Major goes away. 
it's not a no-brainer stomp no more. It's, well, eh, honestly, at that point, it still might even be. We've gotten so much strength while having it due to being able to play, like, super, super silly. Uh, crit, we get crit. One of the best items we could probably have with low but not super low crit. I don't even know. Like, I'm confused why we have so much. Oh, boy. Whoop. Genuinely confused why we have as much as we do. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. 18% crit. Um, just want to level it up. Sure. Health is nothing. If it was a percentage, it'd be a different story. If it was a percentage, that key would cost like 500. Yep. Oh. Ooh, ah, ooh, ah. Ooh, ah. Are we on? We're still on 11. Okay, 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 okay. I feel like I've missed. Hmm. I probably should have. Would the reroll work in here? I don't know. Gonna be silly. I'm gonna do it. Reroll might have worked in there. Da, 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 da. Okay, we're gonna hit level. Eh, just we're gonna hit level three. Literally, just going down to the uh, next floor. What could possibly go wrong? Bloody locks is not a problem, and I'll even take attack speed at this point because there's no way we're getting no megalol. If we, I guess if we would have skipped both of those, there no, they were on the last floor. We can't get Omega Lol. All right, so now when we use a potion, we have a chance to get another potion back for free. Pretty good. I definitely feel like we've um, started to scale uh, backwards. Not backwards. Uh, poorly. <laughs> Not backwards, but just bad. Hmm. There's that old pet biscuits potion. Sure. Okay. And the lock thing is gone already. Yeah. All right. We got the food potion. I, I bought that health potion. I probably should, just, like, you know, use it. The kiss of the vampire or whatever. Vampire's smoocheroo. Mm. Eh. 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 We could leave this just in case we find a major curse that we want to make sure we remove. That's not a dumb idea at all. Uh, Ferocity? It's going to be extra helpful since we should have a pretty good ability to uh, oh, to generate some solid crit chance. Not really happening, though, if I'm going to be honest. Not really. If we could get a crit potion, it'd be obviously great. Um, crit chance item. I mean, I'm, I'm for all of them. This helps our... The, any swing speed helps our throw speed as well. Wait, what? Swing damage helps or throw damage. Ooh, baby. What do we even want right now? What do we want? What do we want out of these? We already have a throw damage up potion, don't we? We do. Is the timer ticking down? It's not. Boy, if there was an even or outer potion, that'd be great. Sure, I'll get a doppelbock. Doppelbock. Beep bop ba doppel bop. We get that and the uh, the extra throw damage when we move down. We're gonna pop everything. I you know there's stuff up there. It doesn't really matter on the last floor here. In our current scenario, we are balling out of control. 
what are we at? We're at 10% crit, 12% crit. Yeah, we're at that si the situation where every hit is pretty much increasing the crit. Hits beget crits. Uh, what is it? Bomb. Increase fall damage. Honestly, fantastic. Ooh. Swing damage, throw size, throw speed. Probably makes more sense than throw speed. Truthfully, like, it's whatever. I mean, uh, throw damage or swing damage does increase our throw s <laughs> damage, throw speed. Swing damage increases our throw speed. What an item that would be. That'd be a weird one. Challenge of the day is to tell me what item logically, thematically, would make sense. Like, I'm talking, if you were to design the item, what would the item be? Like, what would it look like? What would its name be? Everything. That would be a swing damage increases throw speed. The Yeeter? Probably. Something, something along that line. Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. Very possibly a, uh, a Cirque du Soleil there. Yep. I mean, gotta use these bombs somehow, right? Gotta use them somehow. We're on the final. Oh, no. Final little stretch here. <laughs> I'll re-roll the nothing. Okay. Uh, I think we do this serum right now. We go down. We do this right away. I kind of had a feeling it'd be Ponzu. Uh, I think that we just go for it like this for now. And then we, yeah, we figure out where you're going to go. Oh, man. If only... If only we could have just rocked it for a while. That was really, really good for a bit. Bye? <laughs> what? Oh! We made a mistake. The good news is we do so much damage that nothing matters. But look at it. See, you know what? In the end, this is what the run would have looked like if we didn't have that item. Definitely more scary. What is this Griswold the Collector business, though? I'm so confused. <laughs> I mean, whatever. All right. Sure. Okie doke. But alas, alas. Another run bites the dust. Good stuff. That is that, and that is going to do it for today. Huge thank you to Space Time for supporting on Patreon, getting your name on a peasant. A very powerful run, a very fun, unique run right there. Getting a duplicator early is just always a good time. But thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to hit the like button. It takes no time at all. Helps out with the algorithm. Helps it so these videos get seen, and this series thus will stick around. Thank you, thank you, and I will see you next time. Bye.